Hi, good morning. I'm working on a project today. Um, I hope you can see this. Let's see, let me tilt it down some so you can see what I just got. Uh, Brad had a custom farmhouse table and bench built for me. Uh, this was my Christmas present, but we just got it in today. Um, there's a, a man he works with, his name is Roger, and Roger custom built this for us. He tells me that this is gonna be the only one built this way. Um, he will alter the next ones just so that we have a one of a kind piece. And I think that's just so amazing. Um, he did this with old craftsmanship skills. Like there's no nuts and bolts and all that in this table. It's all just carved in and fit together. I can't think of what that's called right now because I don't have that kind of brain. Um, but I am tickled to death with this. And um, I have Roger's information. If anybody would like to have him build you a custom piece, he is more than willing to do that. Um, today, I'm going to, now that we have it in the house, he didn't finish it for me because I wasn't sure exactly what I wanted to do. Um, in fact, when I went to the store the other day, I went to Ackridge and got stain. I got the Minwax um, stains in special walnut and classic gray. And my original plan was to mix the two to kind of give it a weathered look. Um, but then I ordered new chairs this morning and they're basically black, but the seat is in a walnut finish. So I think I'm just going to stick with the walnut on the table and bench. I'm going to do it all completely stained. Um, I kind of toyed with the idea of painting the base black and then staining the top. But I want this to be like a family heirloom piece that never goes out of style. I want it to be a family heirloom because the tabletop um, is made from boards that were planed off Brad's grandfather's farm years ago. And um, they've just been put up and stored and uh, Roger used those to make the, the table um, top. So that's pretty special to us. So I want this to be something that can be used <coughs> in my daughter's house someday, in my granddaughter's house someday. Like I hope that's what this table sees. So today I'm just going to put some stain on it. Uh, once the stain sets in and dries, I'm going to finish the top with polyacrylic. Um, I'm not using polyurethane because polyurethane has a yellowing um, effect to it. Polyacrylic does not. It will clear finish, but it give you a clear finish, but it will also still give you that waterproof effect that polyurethane does. So that's what I'm doing today on this uh, self-quarantine Saturday. I hope you all have some fun projects or something that you're doing. Maybe you're cleaning out stuff. I've been doing that too. Um, something about being within the four walls makes them feel like they're closing in on you. So I've been decluttering and going through some decor pieces and getting rid of stuff like that too. So I hope you're putting this time at home into good use and making the best of it. That's what we're trying to do. Have a good day.